Hello friends, this is Barbara from Wigs and Fluff. In today's video, we're going to be trying on wigs from the storage box. There it is, the storage box. This is the deep storage <laughs> where I put wigs that just don't work for me or I don't like them or something else. I don't like the color or something else is going on. So I thought I would take some of these wigs out. We did this one other time and put try some of them on and see if I like them now. See if I've changed my mind at all. So, but first, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. And to stay to the end so you can get informed on our numbers, where we're at, and get the tease for what we're going to be talking about tomorrow. Now, on to the storage box. Okay, so the first one is the one I'm wearing, and this is the Lizzie by Renee of Paris in, what is it, Strawberry Swirl. Strawberry Swirl. I like the color. The color is fine. I really, I like the Strawberry Swirl color by Renee of Paris. This is a cute little wig, but it's a little too spiky for me. Now, you've seen that I have kind of plastered it down with wig wax spray right here in order to get it to stop. Now, this is a wig that really wants to do this. That's the way it wants to do more than anything else. And it's not my style. It just is not my style. I like things nice and smooth. I like things looking good and it's just not for me. So anyways, I've had to use a lot of wig wax spray to get this thing to settle down. But anyways, it's a cute little wig. I'm gonna turn around and show you the back right now. You can see it. And you can see the back is just PC as well and it's cut up, cut up and PC. Now this is kind of a dark blonde with a strawberry glaze over the top, if you will. They call it strawberry swirl. And it's got a little bit of blondish uh, swirled in there too. It's got its darks and its lights and a little bit, little hint of strawberry in there somewhere. So it's a cute little wig, but I don't know. What do you think? You tell me, do you like this one? Do you like these punky ones? I really worked hard to get this to settle down for me and see it keeps wanting to come right back up. So I've tried to work with it. Now it's a great little wig for summer because it's short, chopped off, and really cute. So it's the inside has a good deal of lace, but that doesn't mean it's not going to be a little cool. It's going to be cool. And, um, it's got closed ear tabs right there. It's got right there closed ear tabs. And it's a cute little wig. Absolutely a cute little wig. So what do you think? Should I keep her or should I put her back into storage camp? What do you think I should do? Should we leave her in storage camp? I don't know. I'm gonna think about that. By the way, when I put them into storage, I put them in a plastic bag like this. I get all of the air out of it so it can be flat and I can get a lot of them in there. I don't have to have too many. But um, anyways, that is that. That is the Lizzie and she's in Strawberry Swirl. So that's one of them. Now I'm going to reach for another one and this is an Envy wig. This is the Jacqueline by Envy. I don't know what was the problem with this one, but we're going to find out. Just not sure what this one's problem was. This is in Vanilla Butter. I like the color. I like the color. Here you can see it's kind of a, it's more of a strawberry blonde, really. It says Vanilla Butter, but that looks like strawberry blonde to me. I don't know. But um, she has an open cap. Look at there. Nice open cap. That is an open cap. 
all the way around. That means no lace. No lace at all in this one, hardly any. And um, it's going to be super cool on these hot summer days. Hot July, August, September days. It's going to be super cool. And it's short, 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 short. This is one of the problems I had with the Jacqueline, I think, is because I would have preferred she was a little bit more generous on the sides, but, you know, there we go. So, what do you think? This is how she looks. And sometimes you can tease it up and fluff it out. It's been sitting in the in the bag for a while. So sometimes you can do that, tease it right up and make it a little bit cuter. So it's an awfully short one for me. Although it does come down pretty long in the back. It's short on the sides, and I think that's what my original problem was with it, because it wasn't, but it is cute. It really is. It's a cute little wig, and I might take this one out. I don't know. What do you think? What do you think of this one, the Jacqueline? I think she can be combed to the side a little bit better, but she's got nice fluffy bangs. It's just that these, it's just the sides. Are a little bit on the short side. A little bit on the short side. But you tell me what you think. Cute as a button. Lots of coolness for the summer days here. The dog days of summer when it's so hot and it's so humid. This one's a good one. This is the Jacqueline in Vanilla Butter. The Jacqueline in Vanilla Butter. So, all right, put that one back in the bag. I always keep them in the bag when I put them into storage camp. There's that one, there's the NV tag. And I put the tag on the outside just like this. And then I hug it to get all of those, all that air out of there. And there she is ready to go back into storage, if I so choose. Now it's up to y'all, what do y'all think? Should I keep her out? Thumbs up or thumbs down? <laughs> I don't know. The next one is an Aesthetica wig. The next one is Aesthetica. And this one is the Krista in Honey Blonde with, light, with a Light Ash Blonde Highlights. Honey Blonde with Light Ash Blonde Highlights. And the tag, I think, says R10-22, I think. It looks like it was misprinted a little bit there, but let's try her on. She is also an open weave cap, pretty much. She's just got this one piece down here. Many of them are constructed differently. You'll see some with piece here. You'll see some with a half moon. You'll see some with full lace. They're, co they're constructed all kinds of different ways. So um, let's put her on. This is the Krista from Aesthetica. Let's see how we like the Krista. See what we think of her now. And this is Honey Blonde with Light Ash Blonde Highlights. Honey Blonde with Light Ash Blonde Highlights. Ooh. Now, I'm kind of thinking I like this one. Um, what do you think? It's an open weave. It comes down nice and long in the back. Look at that. Nice and long in the back. It's a little bit chopped around the ear. especially on the other side. This side seems to have more than this side, unless I've just... I 
don't know, for some reason I like my ears covered. I don't know why. There's nothing wrong with my ears. There. I like it. Oh, this one's coming out of storage. It comes down nice and long, and I love the color. Honey Blonde with Light Ash Blonde Highlights. I really like this one. I think this one is coming out of storage. What do you think? Do you like this one? I think the color is gorgeous. There's no uh, rooting in this at all. No rooting at all. Now this is a cute little wig. So, what do you think about the Krista? The color is beautiful. It's just a golden blonde, honey blonde. Beautiful. You can see the inside is an open weave. Now we do have the old cup and hook. I hate these things. Adjuster, see that one had already fallen out. We have open ear tabs. A nice wide piece on the front, velvet piece, feels like velvet, and um, a tag, and the name of the tag is a little bit messed up. It looks like RH1022, but I'm not sure, but it's just really cute, cute, cute wig. I think this one might be coming out of storage. I like the Krista. It's just a blonde, blonde wig. Maybe that's one of the things that I didn't like about it, that there was no dimension to the wig. It was just, there's no darks and lights. It's all one color, and hair is never all one color. But it does come down nice and long in the back to cover your long hairline. That's a plus, and it does have pretty fluffy bangs. So that one might be coming out of storage. But you let me know what you think about the Krista. Thumbs up or thumbs down. So, all right. The next one is, I don't know about this one. Oh, this is a Rose Star wig. This is one of those Rose Star wigs. I don't know that I meant to put this one in. I think I meant not to do that. I think I'm just gonna put her back in the bag because she does not do right for me. I remember that one and we're gonna go on to the next one, which is a Noriko. There we go, Noriko. I think that rose star, I put it away for a really good reason. And this is the Noriko. Maybe at the end, I'll try it on for you. Just not a good wig. Spring Honey. The Nema in Spring Honey. The Nema by Noriko in Spring Honey. Let's see what this one looks like. Why did I put this one away? This one is a Noriko, so the name kind of like in this one. The name is on the tag is what I started to say. But I'm looking at the color. The color is what distracted me. I really like this color. It says spring honey. But I really I really like I kind of like this one. What do you think? Shall we keep it out of the 
summer camp, storage camp? What do you think? Cute wig, let's look at the inside. I'll turn around, I'll put it on and show you the back again. Now this one has a lot of lace, it's all black lace. You can see it's black lace. And then um, it has a little strip there. It's got uh, closed ear tabs right there. You can see that they're closed. Um, so this is a nice fall wig. So I think I'm going to keep this one out. I kind of like it. I kind of like this one. The bangs are hard to find, I will say that. They're a little bit on the indistinct side. It's hard to, hard to find them in here. There they are. All right, so let's turn around and just look at the back of it. Beautiful. Look how pretty that is. Gorgeous. I mean, you would never know that that was a wig. That is just so very well done. So, I think this one is going to be kept out. The Nema and Spring Honey. All right. Now, the next one... The last one, really, I might do the other one, is a John Renault. And this one is in a petite. Now, I took this one out because I want to show you the petite on my head. It looks okay, but it's tight on my 21 and 1 quarter inch head. This is the Natalie in buttermilk. Now, this particular color is okay. I think I gave it some rooting because it was so pale. I'm not sure. But this is the Natalie. And as I recall, see I gave it some rooting. It just needed a little something. think this is an asymmetrical one, a little asymmetrical, and the back needs a little bit of combing. It's been in the storage. I just pulled it out. Let me show you the other side. So this is the Natalie. This is one of the ones that I put, uh, as I recall, rooting in it because it was just so buttermilk and so one color. But it's cute. Um, it doesn't come down quite long enough in the back. The back is a bit of a problem. It's a pretty hairline, but I have my hair come, that comes down the back there, so... I think this one's going to go back to uh, freezer camp, or not freezer camp, but storage camp. And uh, I've got three of them that I'm thinking of putting back into storage camp. But you tell me what you think. So, what we've had here is we've had the first one was the Lizzie, um, then I think it was the Noriko Nima, oh, or the Krista, then the Krista, then the Envy, the Jacqueline, then the Nima, and then the uh, Natalie in buttermilk. So those are the five. The ones that I have out that I might keep the Noriko one, 
and the Krista by Aesthetica in the Honey Blonde. I think those two I'm going to keep out, but I think the, uh, the Natalie, the Jacqueline, and the Lizzie. What do you think about the Lizzie? I'm, I'm, on, the, I'm on the fence about the Lizzie. I think those might go back to storage camp. All right, one last one. I'm going way too long here, but one last one. I said I might put this back on for you. This one was the uh, Rose Star one. Not really crazy about the whole idea of this one. There's no tag in it, so it's hard to know. But, oh, yeah, I remember. This one is way too big. Way, way, way too big. It, it's supposed to be an average, but it fits like a large. The color is nice. The color is okay. I don't know. The back is good. Comes down nice and long. Cover my hairline. The color is beautiful. The color is gorgeous. There is no color on it. It just says uh, mixed blonde. It just says mixed blonde. But you can see it's got a lot of problems because there's so much hair going in different directions that it's hard to comb it. It doesn't want to go one particular way or another. But I don't know. Sometimes, this is one of those $20 wigs, by the way, Rose Star, is one of those $20 wigs on the internet. So you tell me what you think about this one. It's hard to know where that goes. I'm kind of liking this one now that I've got it on. Color is really kind of cute. Not too bad. Oh, what do you think? This is one of those $20 ones, the Rose Star, and it just says mixed blonde. So you just don't know what in the world you're getting. But the ear tabs are enormous, I will say that. They're really big. But the uh, the bangs are done really well. I mean, it goes to the side. I don't know. I imagine that it will fall on my face. doesn't seem to want to. I kind of like this one. I don't know. I may take this one out of storage camp. What do you think? The $20 Rose Star in mixed blonde. <laughs> you tell me what you think about this one. This one is super cute, really is, but it fits really, really big. Anything, any gust of wind is going to take this one. The fit is really awful on this one, but, and in the inside, it does have lace, a large amount of lace. And cup and hook adjusters, you know, a nice velvet in the front, in the back, a small strip of velvet, closed ear tabs. I don't know. I might keep her out for a while. What do you think? This is that Rose Star, the $20 wig. So, I don't know. Let's, that's one that I'm thinking about. But I'm going to put the Krista back on for now because I kind of like her. She's kind of cute. I'm going way, way long. Too far long, I know. But I've just been having fun with my storage wigs. Having fun with my storage wigs. Okay, so now I want to talk to you about something else. I want to talk to you about Jesus. He is the answer. Jesus is the answer to all the problems that you are having. When life is difficult, he's the answer. He loves you so much. He loves you. He wants to help you. You only have to believe in your heart that he raised him from the dead, that he raised Jesus from the dead. 
and Jesus is Lord. Say it with your mouth and believe it in your heart and you will be saved. You will be saved. No matter what you are going through in life, Jesus will be with you. He will send the angels concerning you and help you through it. And you can trust him. You can trust him. Now, I have on the Krista by Aesthetica in Honey Blonde. It's kind of a cute little wig, and I think this one's coming out of storage camp. So, I don't know. Really kind of cute. I don't mind wearing this one. I like it a lot. Okay, so tomorrow, in tomorrow's video, we will be comparing reds, red wigs, one of my favorites, from Paula Young, Aesthetica, Aesthetica, Raquel Welsh, and others. So five wigs, five reds, and five manufacturers. So don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. And we are at 952 and holding. We get closer every day. So don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.